check out these recent articles as I share something with you. As students of prophecy, we know that the planned demic is nothing more than the Pope's way of setting up things for when he uses climate change to enforce Sunday laws, claiming if we refuse to keep Sunday holy, everyone on earth will die in the increasing disasters. This is why the Pope met with every politician and every CEO the last few years to make sure that when they pass Sunday laws, wherein no one can buy or sell unless they keep Sunday holy and prove it, as prophesied long ago, all the political leaders and all the CEOs have already agreed to do as Rome demands. The fact every nation on earth is playing along in all this, and the media has been pushing this fake pandemic 24 hours a day, seven days a week, confirms all this hands down. Now, as you are seeing the articles wherein people are being persecuted and even killed for refusing to wear masks, when we all know masks don't work, how hard will it be for Satan to use the exact same types of people to persecute and even kill Christians who refuse to keep Sunday holy when we all know there's not a single Bible verse from Genesis to Revelation that says God ever changed the seventh-day Sabbath to the first day of the week. As I said in a previous video, what we're seeing now is an echo of 66 AD. And as soon as this fact-finding mission that they call 19 helps them cover every base needed to enforce the mark, just as they saw back in 70 AD, the real Roman attack will begin against God's people. That all being said, are you ready for what's about to happen in the coming months and years? If not, then you need to study the Word of God daily and pray like you have never prayed before. As John the Baptist said 2,000 years ago in Matthew chapter 3, verse 3, Prepare ye the way of the Lord, make his paths straight. Thank you for watching. God bless.